Hey guys, how are you? Yakov here. So today I'd like to cover a personal improvement topic, specifically about implementing new changes and new habits in your life. So this is a trick that Sean E. Mahar, an executive coach in effective communication, have shared with me and I'm going to link to his uh, website below and I'm also going to link to his one hour free uh, course that he shared on his website about effective communication or up here if you're on LinkedIn. So I'm going to share with you my experience and my example and you can just think how it relates to you and just change my example with your example. So right now I'm working on my communication skills and specifically I'm working on my paraphrasing skills. And what I do is I paraphrase what the other person says so that I understand better what they're saying and, and also I show evidence to them that I'm listening to them and that I understand what they're saying and if I missed it they could you know, correct me. So as the day goes by and I reflect on the day, I notice that I'm not practicing uh, paraphrasing. So that was a problem. Uh, and mainly the reason is because I simply forget to do it. It's a new habit and I'm going back to my old habits. So the question is, how am I uh, going to implement new habits and make sure that I remember them and I practice them and I keep on working on them so that they become ingrained and they become my new habit. So I shared this experience with Sean and he asked me, would you spend 10 cents a day learning a new behavior that was important for you? And of course I said yes. Uh, so he shared with me this trick. The idea is here that you take 10 cents and you put it in your pocket, left pocket for example, and as you practice your behavior and you notice that you practiced it, you take one cent from your left pocket and transfer it to your right pocket. Very simple. And next time you face another situation and you practiced your behavior, or for in this case, like I paraphrased uh, what the person said, in a natural way, of course. Um, take a cent from my left pocket and put it in my right pocket. And that's it. So the goal here, of course, is to find yourself at the end of the day with 10 full cents in your right pocket. So here's my experience with this method. I used to practice paraphrasing twice a day without this method. With this method, now I you know, achieve 10 by noon. Uh, and that's very good, I, that's what I want. And I feel that because I'm practicing more, naturally it will be more and more ingrained in my mind and I would be able to turn it into an automatic behavior at some point. Another reason is that the coins make it a very measurable way to see how you are progressing and look at your success and feel it. So what it does is it brings the thoughts that are not physical into the physical world and you give it a symbol and you actually see the progress that way. You make it physical, measurable and sensory. So my challenge to you is to pick a habit and then find 10 cents and I know these to, tend to be hard to find these days so go to a dollar store and buy a pen and ask for uh, pennies back. So if you're interested in improving your communication effectiveness, I really recommend for you to check out Sean's free one hour course. You don't have to give any information, no email, no first name, last name, nothing. It's a direct link. So watch this one hour free course because what you say may not be what they hear. Thank you very much for today. If you are interested in personal development and if you live in the Boston area, I started a new LinkedIn group. It's called Personal and Professional Development Network. Uh, find it on LinkedIn and please join. Thank you very much. My name is Yakov.